good morning students in today's class let us learn about line numbers in ms word as well as shapes in ms word we can add line numbers to the left edge of every line in ms word it is used to refer to the location of the line while proof reading the document so when we add line number to our document it is easy for us to read so ila ban pendon kam ya line number habang tho jing tho haka an as word document kum pin pe ya kan ka dor ba menta pin u ik don kin ki line numbers shakal yang ka diang te kalong ka basuk ladang isu ong menta pe ya ka line number lai dan ye basan bat kum ta ter ter we can add the line numbers by following few steps The first is to click on page layout tab in the document as shown here with point number 1. Next point number 2 is to click on line numbers down arrow in page setup group. Then a drop down list of menu will appear. After that, we can click on the options on how we want the line numbers to appear. For example, we want Roman one to three, or we want simple numerical one to three. Then we can choose the options as required. And if you don't want any line numbers to appear, then you can click on none, as shown here in point number three. So I hope that is clear. Now let us move on with another topic which is shapes. So we will learn on how to work with shapes in MS Word. MS Word 2010 gives a large collection of shapes. We can add one shape to the file or combine multiple shapes to make a drawing or a more complex shape. Available shapes include lines, geometric shapes, arrows, equation shapes flow chart shapes banners and call outs my dear students can you give example of basic geometric shapes yes some of the shapes are squares circles triangle and so on you can also draw stars clouds and other shapes don shibon ki shapes ki bangila ban draw ka ms word document kita ki long Bandroa ya ka basau dong ka ba pelun la ni kino kino ki shape kum u kudur la ni kilo o bat kum ta ter ter ti mentang ini pe kum no bandroa ya kita ki shape haka ms word now let us learn on how to add shapes in ms word as well as resizing those shapes we can do that by following few steps such as number 1 to select the insert tab so first of all you have to select the insert tab as shown here in point 1 next is click the shapes command the shapes command is available here as shown in point 2 next is select a shape from the drop down menu so here you can see in point number 3 we are selecting star shape but there are many shapes whereby you can select as per your requirements after that you can click and drag the mouse until the shape is formed to the desired size suppose you want to change the size of the shape of this star also you can do that so now let us learn on how to resize a shape so the first step that we need to follow to resize a shape is to click on the shape to select it now you can see after clicking the shape there are holders now you can see the star it is inside the square box small small square box this these are known as holders after that you can click and drag one of the siding handles on the corners and sides of the shape until it is of the desired size that means you can click on one of those square box or the holders or the handles to increase or decrease the size that means to make it bigger or smaller as you like 
ti min tang in ye pet kum no ban pin kala ye ka jing he la ni ka jing red chong u ni u star la ni u ni klor u bang la dep ban ro kata ka english ni khat resizing a ship here you can see the three stars look at the different size of the ship given here if we drag the sizing handles on any of the four corners, we will be able to change the height and width at the same time. So if you want to change the height and the width, both you can do that. So the sizing handles on the top or bottom of the shape will only allow us to resize vertically. While the handles on the left and right sides will resize the shapes horizontally. Kabamut balada pikwa ban penhe yakini ki shapes kumahang ni kani ka example ukulur tapi kwa ban penhe yung ni ukulur pila ban klik hakini ki handles lani kini ki placeholder hang ni pi la klik kum ni bat pila ban penhe yaka size kat kum ka jing kwa jang pi pila ban penhe shajrong lani shatrai lani shakin riang kat ba pikwa that's all my dear student. You just need to follow the few steps in order to insert line numbers as well as to insert shim. We will stop here for today and we will meet again in the next video with another topic.